Can Midland Funding throw you in jail if you fail to pay? My name is Michael Wasik. I'm a lawyer with Ricardo and Wasik here in Florida, and together my partner Jason Ricardo and I help people just like you overcome foreclosure and debt collection with dignity. And today I'm going to answer the question of whether or not Midland Funding can have you thrown in jail if you fail to pay. Now, before we answer that question, it's important to understand who Midland Funding is and how they get leverage over you. They are a junk debt buyer and a debt collector and they buy old credit card debt and other debt once it's in default, once it's charged off, for pennies on the dollar and they hope to extract nickels, dimes, or even quarters in order to make their profit. And the way they do that is they file thousands of, for, of uh, debt collection lawsuits all over the state of Florida every month in order to get judgments against people just like you. Now, the, what happens when they get a judgment? Then they have the right to collect the debt. And that's what you want to avoid. Now, the reason most people make the mistake and have a judgment entered against them is because they don't know how to respond properly and they don't know how to respond timely. So they either ignore it or they do something wrong and they admit the debt and the judge enters a judgment against them for the full amount of the debt, even though they probably could have beat it if they just tried to contest it. So it is important that if you get sued by Midland Funding, you actually respond properly and in time. I'm going to tell you at the end of the video how to do that. Now, if they get a judgment, they have a right to collect from you. And the way they collect is by garnishing wages, by seizing bank accounts, by seizing vehicles and other property. But they also have a right to compel you to give up information about where your assets are, what bank accounts you have, where you keep your money, what your income is. And if you fail to respond to that, the judge can hold you in contempt of court. They can fine you and maybe even throw you in jail. Now, you, that's a only happens in extreme cases where a debtor has willfully refused, where somebody who has a judgment against them has willfully refused to fill out that form. It's very rare. There's no such thing as a debtor's prison in Florida, but if you fail to obey the court order uh, that the judge has entered, you may be exposed to going to jail. Uh, you know, recently there's a big uh, controversy about someone who skipped jury duty. And, uh, and, and he was sentenced to 10 days in jail. Now, if you violate a court order, the court can throw you in jail. You don't want that to happen. Now, you, ge you generally can't go to jail just for not paying a debt. But if you break that court order, then maybe in some circumstances you can. And that's what you want to avoid. Now, earlier I said there's a way to avoid having that judgment entered against you at all by responding timely and properly, by having the proper response in the right time. And I promised you that I would help you figure out a way to do that and we will. We're gonna give you a free 30-minute strategy session so that you know how to respond to a Midland Funding lawsuit and when you need to respond to it and what the best way is to protect yourself from having your wages garnished, from having your bank accounts drained, from having your other property seized, and from having to give up that information uh, form that provides all your assets so you don't expose yourself to a contempt of court uh, and possible jail time. My name is Michael Wasik, my partner Jason Ricardo and I uh, we'll uh, gladly give you 30 minutes of our time. What you need to do is call 352-567-3173. That's 352-567-3173. Now, we're in court most days, so we have appointments set aside. We have a limited number of slots. If you want one of those slots, there's a lot of people contesting for those, so you need to get to the head of the line. Call right now. And if you missed that number, it's 352-567-3173. Mention this video, which is Can Midland Funding Throw Me in Jail? And we'll give you that free 30-minute strategy session at the first available appointment. So I hope this video has been helpful to you. I hope to see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.